Okay, so I'm going to make this as quick as possible. How to make peanut butter keto coffee. Alright, my way. Organic stuff is the best idea. Okay. The MTC oil I found at Walmart, close to the uh, where you get your prescriptions for medications. Okay, so you have a hard time finding it, just ask somebody back here and uh, they'll find it for you. Just make sure they know it's MCT oil. Okay. All right. So I was doing a video, and while I was doing that video, the video stopped. Okay, sorry. So what I had done was I already put the butter in there, okay, which, here I can pull it out. Okay, which was that much. Like two tablespoons. That's the way I see it. And I put two packages of stevia in there. Okay. So, moving right along. And I pray this video don't get messed up somehow. Alright. Um, to put the MTC oil in here. Unfortunately. You know what? I might be able to do something here. Maybe. Maybe. God, I hope it don't mess nothing up. I might get lucky by put in my phone up in this cupboard. Ha ha! Hot diggity dog. That was a good idea. Alright, so there's the blender. Okay. Then I take the MTC Or MCT. See, I, I, I get that mixed up. <laughs> Always get mixed up on that. Okay. You see it. No questions about it. Okay. There we go with that. It's the way I found that I like it. Alright. And the peanut butter, the star of the show. I'm going to do a helping. Big helping of it. Ain't got to be exact, precise, but that's the way I like it. Get in there. Go on, get. Yeah, it's being a pain in the butt. So we'll just put that back in the jar. Save that peanut butter. That's some expensive peanut butter. No, it's not. It's not that expensive. <laughs> look about. Look at it this way. If you do fasting and you're on the keto diet and all that, you know you're saving money every month compared to the way you used to eat. That's truth. Hey, that's the truth. Because uh, if you're fasting for a day or fasting for two days or whatever, whatever you care to do, you know. And if you're just doing this for the good taste that it is, hey, there you go. Rock and roll. Alright, so we're done with that. Move that out the way. Um, I might get this. Probably about a, what, a teaspoon, half a tablespoon. It works. It works just fine like mine. Okay. This is awesome though. I mean, without the peanut butter in it, it was good. It was, it's real good without it. But, you know, I just, I 
got an idea one day and I was like oh my god I like that you know so I always keep it in the lid to see how much because too much of this salt and putting salt in here is good if you're fasting okay good thing to do if you're fasting and then the almond milk okay which what I really like to do truthfully is I like to put my coffee in my mug okay because no matter what I always end up making more than I thought once you get done blending it okay so I go about there can you see that I hope you can see that and then I'll bring this up and you gotta compensate for everything that's in the blender already too okay keep that in mind right, maybe just a tad bit more okay so there's probably what, like, about an inch from the rim down, okay? You definitely got to compensate for what's in the blender, all right? So, pour this without getting it everywhere. All right. Now it's for the magic. Magic. Uh -huh. All right, let's see if we can get the phone down here. And uh, I hope to film the video and all that ain't all flipped sideways and whatnot. If I if it is, I apologize for that. You know, I'm a rookie at doing all this mess, so I think if I hold it this way, it's the best idea. So, let's get this show started. Start with it slow. Make sure it mixes real good. You know what I mean? Probably a lot of overkill but look if you look at this you can see the from here down is the actual coffee and from here up is what they call the froth frost or froth I don't know but the uh, boy is that good stuff Maynard let me tell you what 
it's all good. I don't know which part of it I like the best, though. I mean, that's the uh, honest God's truth. There's a froth right up on top. You know, mm mm mm. That's good stuff right there, Maynard. Let me tell you what. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let me, let me pour this in here. Now, watch. Like I told you, it's going to be more than you think. Still got a little bit down there. So, that's okay. We know what to do with that. <laughs> we know what to do with that. Don't you worry. So, if I can get this bone right. I'm going to try and turn it around on myself, but I don't know if I'm going to get myself on the video, but And that's how you make keto coffee. Um, well, keto coffee. If you just want to make keto coffee or butter coffee, um, don't put the peanut butter in it. You know. But I appreciate you watching this video. If you watched it to the end, God bless you. Because uh, <laughs> you know how that goes, man. A lot of people start watching a video and they feel like, man, this is taking too long. And they just shut it off. Or until they find out what they want to know. And they turn it off. So... If you've made it to the total end of this video, God bless you, and I appreciate it. And you have yourself a beautiful day or a beautiful evening, whatever the case might be for you right now in time. Catch you next time. And to my radio friends, catch you on the air or catch you back here. God bless. Take care. Your audio man. I'm up. Getting healthy. And gone now. I can get this thing to turn off.